Gareth, 2017 has been a pretty special year all round for everyone at this club, but uh, that's a great way to sum it up tonight. Yeah, fantastic, isn't it? You know, it just sort of shows right across the last two weeks. Um, we've played for, for the full 80 minutes. It might have felt actually, you know, guys were a wee bit maybe down at half time, but actually the hard work we actually put in that first half really allowed us to play as well as we did in the second half. And we reaped all the rewards and we got away with the five points. And it shows if you keep going right to the 80th minute, you can get everything out of the game. So we're delighted with that. Rob just talked about there was two periods there, start of the second half, where you had to dig deep and you turn them over on your own line and then you reap your rewards at the other end. Yeah, no, look, it it, it was difficult conditions out there, um, you know, for both sides. And, Definitely, you know, going in at half time, leading albeit with 6 3, it was, um, you know, it was Were you good a little to be. frustrated at half time? A little. Uh, it, it, it's like anything, you know, it was always going to be one of those days where it was really quite tough. The conditions were hard. Um, we like to play with a high tempo game, um, and maybe some guys were getting a little frustrated. It is frustrating at times because you kind of feel you're getting close to scoring, but ultimately, those were the moments that were sort of setting us up for the second half. and. You know, going out in that second half, we definitely we we knew we had a knuckle down defensively. We're very very pleased with how we went because there's a side there who've come and tr threw everything at us to try and score, and we've kept them to six points. And you know, and we had to fight a lot of times on our line as well. So, um, as much as it's great to get the four tries as well, it's very pleasing that we've only conceded six points. Is that a statement of intent? Though, the way you went about that second half, four tries into the wind against a really top Leicester Tigers side. Yeah, it is. Um, you know, we, we we don't mind playing against the wind. Um, sometimes it can can be a little bit easier to play against the wind because you actually, whenever you keep the ball, it's quite easier maybe just to make your passes and stuff. Um, you know, and it's it's it might you know, you've got to work hard, obviously. Um, but I think we've got that kind of group of guys that we really set a good stall out in the first half. Um, but it mightn't have looked at at the time, but we did, and it really set us up really well for the second half. You'll remember this year probably mostly for for May and what happened at Twickenham, but. How do you go about going into the new year now? Yeah, it's exciting, isn't it? You know, we're in a really good place. Um, we've, we've talked very much about trying to keep the season in our hands. And at the minute, you know, if we keep going the way we're going, um, we're going to be in great shape. And that's all we can sort of focus on on a week to week basis is really going out, ultimately looking to perform to the best of our ability. You know, we, we know we can be better than we were today, um, which is great uh, going forward. And we've got a great squad of guys who are pushing each other every week. Um, we've got some injury guys coming back as well, which is like fresh guys coming into the squad, and it's really good that we're all fighting each other for the jersey. So um, it's only pushing the club forward. I just asked Lockie what was his highlights, and he said there's too many to mention. But for you, what, what really stands out? <laughs> well, I think that as a, as a year, it's just been right across the board. I think um, obviously the Mayor's obviously up there, um, whether it be the semi-final and the final, both the occasions were fantastic and. Um, you know, for me, um, I've had a few, obviously, you know, coming out here in August and having such a good support for a testimonial game was a real highlight for me as well. To have so many guys come back from the championship was fantastic. And But from a playing point of view, it's just nice to come in every week and train with these guys and really push the club forward. And it's, I'm really enjoying my rugby at the minute. 150 premiership appearances, 250 overall. It's not a bad place to be. Can we see 300? <laughs> well, we'll see. We'll see how we go. I see how the body holds up. Yeah, like I said, I'm really enjoying my rugby at the minute. Um, you know, the guys are all fighting each other for places. I'm no different. I'm trying to, you know, play as well as I can, and um, hopefully, you know, if we can keep keep pushing forward, and um, you know, it's a nice milestone to get. Um, don't know how many more there might be than milestones, but you know we'll we'll keep pushing it. And uh, like I said, I just try to take things very much on a week-to-week -week basis, and I'm really enjoying it. And a pint and the standoff to celebrate tonight. Yeah, there'll be one or two uh, to celebrate the new year in there tonight. Yeah. Cheers, Stephen.